I'm thinking we're going to use a stem. So never felt so cold in my life. Oh, Dave, this will cheer you up, buddy. There we go. Let's find that rope. There's the rope. Let's go. He's just like a little speed freak. Okay, Dave, let's go for a jog, shall we? Forming the duties of his office. Of Digby C. Caesar. No. Something's making me feel really tired. I was just going to say, it feels like the uh, stim is wearing off there. Um, okay, well, here's what we're going to do, Dave. We are going to eat some salty foods. So beef jerky, I think, is a good one. Get our thirst to drop a little bit. And then we are going to chug a little bit more coffee. Oh, actually, you know what? Now that our thirst is down to half, let's just pop another stim. We'll save the coffee for afterwards. Perfect timing. Oh, you can lay down a minute, Dave. Don't worry about it. We'll take care of that for you. All right, we're going to holster the gun. We are going to really quick get our lantern on and see if we can find anything else good in here real quick. All right, there is another lantern, another hacksaw. Actually, ours is 90%. Should be fine. Take an extra flare. I don't know why I'm grabbing another sewing kit, but I am. Anything good in there? Lantern fuel. That was what we needed. Nothing else we can use, though. Matches. Um, alright, well, Dave, I tell you what. Oh, let's check the corner really quick. Mountaineering rope, don't care. A couple arrows, don't care. Rifle cleaning kit would be nice because we used ours up. So, yeah, let's grab a little bit of sleep. What do you say? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Another friggin' blizzard, really? Oh, for God's sakes. And I'm freezing bloody cold. Alright, well, here's a thought. We need friggin' water anyway. Just grab a bunch of this crap. Have a quick fire. Thank you. You're fine. You are absolutely, 100%, unequivocally fine. Okay? So chill Looks out. Like it worked. What you gonna wait? Of course you made it work. We used accelerant, you nitwit. All right, let's just throw on all the extra firewood we got because we don't care about any of it. And there you go, six hours of fire. Let me take that tinder plug in case I need it later on. Now, let's make some water. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's have some peaches, maybe? Let's eat something that's in a can anyway so we can have an extra can. Oh, let's eat the 50% ones. <laughs> I tend to forget that I don't have cooking five on this challenge, so maybe not the best idea to eat gunky food. Okay, now we've got water. It's actually daytime. It seems like the blizzard has stopped. Excellent. We can see where we're going. So, yep, let's head for the summit, shall we? Oh, don't start yawning now, dude. you still got a lot of climbing to do before the end of the day. Okay, two encumbered. Let's have a look at the weight and see what we can drop. I think we can drop the wood. That should lighten us up perfectly. Let's go. There you go, Dave. You made it. You are tired, however, so let's chug a few more coffees. 
Get your energy levels up, and let's keep pressing on, shall we? I'm gonna need to rest soon. Oh, okay. Well, apparently I'm only gonna be able to drink two. Not a big deal. We're almost to the halfway point. Okay, Dave, we're at the cave. Now's your chance to warm up a little bit, buddy. Let's get some lights on in this joint. And let's get going. Not sure why I feel so tired. Oh, I got a pretty good idea, Dave. I would imagine it's because you've been running like hell across four maps in two days. <laughs> Alright, Dave, that was it. That's all the warming up you get. Now, please try not to get too tired before we get to that next rope. Okay, is there by any chance an energy drink in here anywhere, please? Take nope, this tell you what. We'll take crackers, we'll take the knife, we'll take a little lantern fuel. Please have an energy drink. I need energy drinks. Alright, well, water's better than nothing. Okay, well, it took forever because we're actually walking into the wind, I think. But we have made it to the first of the two ropes we need to climb. And unfortunately, Dave is just about done for. So yeah, we're at 50% health at the moment. We are, I would imagine, incredibly overburdened. And we are just about dead. But somehow, we've got to find a way to get up this rope. And I'm thinking I might risk it for a biscuit here. All right, Dave, what kind of shape are we in? We are freezing, we're drained. We are well and truly overweight. Um, okay, well, I'm gonna do something incredibly stupid. I am basically going to drop all kinds of crap here. You know what, let's eat the maple syrup, get our calories up as full as we can get them. So yes, eat that, eat that. Um, you know what, we might as well Eat a little bit of venison. I completely forgot we had that on us. So there we go. We're going to drop the venison. We're going to drop the soup. Actually, we're going to drop pretty much everything. So all of that can go. That can go. That can go. The peanut butter can go. Peaches can go. I will keep the crackers. I'll keep the soda. Drop the two sardines. I'm going to drop a liter of water. Because I don't need that much. Oh, actually, hold on. Let's have a drink first. Oh, no, 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 no. Cancel, cancel, cancel. I forgot. I don't want to drink that. Yes, let's drop a liter of water. Yeah, what I want to drink is a coffee. So let's have a quick coffee. That should hopefully get our energy up just enough to be able to make it up this rope, yes? I don't know if it will or not, but I tell you what, it will if we pop a stem. <sighs> Alright, Dave, go. Go, 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 go. We're going to make as much friggin' distance as we can before this stem wears off. Okay, we're up, we're over, we're armed, and we're off. Whoops, that's the wrong bloody way, Digby. You want to go this way. Oh crap, I think it's about to wear off. Please don't wear off, please don't wear off. Just get me a little bit further. We don't have that much farther to go. Too tired to think straight. Crap. All right. Well, here's the thought then. Have a coffee. That'll keep you awake enough to at least not take damage. Ah, oh, crap. All right. Well, we're back to walking for a little while. That's fine. Oh, crap. I forgot about this rope. All right. Well, we'll do the same thing we did last time. We will just pop a stem if we have to and hope for the best. Now, do I have to pop a stim is the question. I do. Oh, I've got a sprained wrist, really? When the hell did that happen? Okay, well, I can sort that out easy enough. I'm not going to worry about the pain. Now, can I climb is the question. I mean, it's not a huge climb. 
Too encumbered. Alright, well, how about if we pop a stim? Can I climb then? Yes, yes I can. Alright, Dave, we ready? Let's rock and roll. Come on, buddy, quick, pull the stim wears off. Up again. Oh crap, Dave, you're fine. Here, have your last coffee. Ah, oh, damn it. I was really hoping to have a couple extra before we got to the top. Oh, <laughs> you don't have any friggin' run anyway, so it's all good. Just relax. We're almost out of here. I promise you, we will be getting some rest soon, okay? I can't keep pushing you. You're almost dead, so yeah. I'm definitely gonna have to suck it up and just take a nap at some point. I would really prefer, however, to do it at the top of Temple Wolf Mountain. Can't feel my feet. Oh, you're fine, Dave. The question actually is, can we get to the rope before we run out of oomph? And it's gonna be close because we are just about out of oomph. Oh, come on, Dave. We can do this, buddy. We can do this. All you gotta do is stay awake for just a couple more minutes. Okay, well, we made it. It's all gonna come down to, can we get up this rope with a stem, or are we gonna fail and die here? Oh, we're gonna make it. Okay, beautiful. Go, 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 Dave. Go, go, go. All right, well, we made it, and oh look, boss. Now, regrettably, we don't have one more cup of coffee to do the keep our energy thing back up, so we are gonna take a little bit of damage before we get a fire going. However, I don't think it's gonna be that bad. And we just gotta find a couple of pieces of wood, and we're minted. Okay, there's another one. Um, okay, accelerant's gonna be good. Grab a couple of matches. We're probably gonna get a bunch of stuff, and we're gonna have to leave a ton of it behind. But, oh, you know what? We actually only need the gun and one flare, but we might as well take them all. Okay, another hacksaw we don't need. Yeah, what I need right now, game, is wood. Please tell me you've got more than these two crappy little pieces in here. Nope, oh, that's a flashlight. Alright, well, I'm gonna start the fire here, I think. Assuming the game will let me. And we're going to throw everything into it that we've got. If I have to, I'll duck back outside and grab some sticks real quick. Okay. How long is that? 58 minutes? Plus two? Am I still warming up? I'm still warming up. Why can I not hack up the slim? Oh, I don't have a hatchet? Seriously? Okay, well, which one of you is the tools? Oh, I can't remember which one's the tools. Well, you know what? We can break up boxes, at least. So how about we do that? I'm still warming up. Perfect. Yeah, break that down. And let's chuck those on the fire. I know, it was close. It's fine. Okay, now we got two hours. Let's go do this one. And that's going to get us up to... What? We got three hours and nine minutes, so we should be able to take a four hour nap, I think. 
Um, yeah, let's put the bedroll down. Yes, please. And let's... Uh, we should be fine on thirst, but yeah, here. Let's just have a soda. And let's get some sleep. Oh, I wanted to sleep four hours, not one idiot features. Okay, well, we still got two hours five. Is there another box in range we can break down? Uh, you know what? Let's go for a big one. I'll probably regret this because I'm going to get cold over here, but... Oh, no, actually, we're fine in the uh, temperature department. Okay, let's add all of those. And that's got us three hours and a half, so yeah, we should be able to get four hours of sleep, I would think. Okay, Fire, how you doing? You're on embers. Um, can I get a stick or two to keep this going? Please and thank you. Anybody? Anywhere? Sticks? Hello, sticks. I know you're hungry. Dude, chill. It's fine. I just need a stick. Uh, you know what? I have a sneaking feeling the fire's just gonna die on us is what's gonna happen there. And it's gone. Okay, well... We're kind of freezing, but we can get another fire going at least. It's gonna hurt. A little bit, but better nothing. Here. Start another fire. I don't have tinder, really? Okay. Well, I know there's newsprint around here somewhere. I've seen it. Like right there, for example. Now can I have a fire, please? Thank you. Okay. Let's add all the fuel we've got. And let's take advantage of our... Cold is well, what little bit of... Thick. Okay. Thank you, Dave. As I was trying to say, let's take advantage of the time we've got, and let's start cracking open some of these crates. Now, that one should be guns and medicine. I think this one's the tools, maybe? Oh, you know what? Can I get it from this side? Because that would be right brilliant. Oh, are you really going to complain about that? All right, well, not an issue. We got plenty of food and water. Kinda. <laughs> Okay, Dave, are you happy now? Can I please get back to work? I think this one's the tools. It's either this one or this one. And yeah, once we get a hatchet, we'll hack up the limb and then we'll be okay for the rest of this. Just what I need. That was exactly what I wanted was the tools. Okay, fire, you're gonna last for two more hours. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna hack this thing up. And I'm gonna crack open some more crates. I need anything right about now. Okay, we've been through all the crates except the medicine and the weapons. We've gotten all of our clothing and we've swapped it out. So we are now at a 21% heat bonus. We've broken down a few crates. So we got 11 hours of friggin' fire. Oh, you know what? I think I'm looking around an extra ton of food, too, because I don't think I've dropped it yet. So, yeah. Basically, what we're going to do is we are going to eat like kings. I say that. We're basically going to eat an awful lot of peanut butter and drink a lot of soda. And then, yeah, we're going to get a full night's sleep, and then we are off to the lighthouse. Okay, so the next morning, the blizzard is done. We are still actually really thirsty. So I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to actually drink as many sodas as we can before we hit the road. I should have enough left to hopefully fill my thirst bar up, I would think. And then, yeah, we're getting the hell out of here, and we are off and running. And I don't think we're going to have to take any more naps either, because I should have a metric ton of coffee on me. Okay, can't drink anymore, so, yep, that's full. Actually, let me, uh, let me check this real quick. Okay, so, we want to, yeah, okay, select. Okay, well, I didn't exactly have a metric ton, but I did have a fair bit. Now, one more thing I want to do before we head out... I absolutely forgot that I want to check the medicine container, and hopefully we can find a few more stems. This stuff will come in handy.
Okay, well, we did get two at least, which means we now have two left for the trip home. Let me just make sure we got the flare gun. We do. Let's reload it, so we'll have that ready to go when we get to the lighthouse. Assuming we make it to the lighthouse. And yeah, I think we're ready. Now for the fun part, we get to Skyrim down the mountain. Just like that. The only downside was we did get a sprained ankle. Luckily, whoops. Luckily, we got plenty of bandages and plenty of painkillers. So that is not going to be an issue. Whoops. We want painkillers, Digby. There you go. All right, get your gun out because we're back in wolf territory. And yeah, let's get the hell out of here. I don't feel so good. Oh, whoops, we just fucked that up. Oh, wow, did I f that up? Yeah, I know, we screwed up. We screwed up big time. Hopefully it's not gonna kill us. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, that just struck me really funny. Well, you know what? Oddly enough, I was about to say, okay, well, we took a wrong turn, but it didn't cost us too much time, as long as we don't run into the bear. And lo and behold, we just ran into the bear. So I am thinking I need to find somewhere, well, preferably as high up as possible... I don't like that I have to get a little closer to him to do it, but if I can just get up here a little ways. Um, Mr. the Bear, where did you go? Okay, he's over there. Yeah, I just need to be up here somewhere where he can't get to me. In fact, can I just creep along the top of this, please, Dave? Pretty please with sugar on it. And then let's say we just run like hell. Okay, there's Timberwolf done and dusted. Now, how quick can we make it across the Pleasant Valley map? Actually, what time is it? Um, okay, we still got a couple hours of daylight left, give or take. Oh, and we have three days and 20 hours left to finish the challenge. Uh, you know what? Usually I would just Skyrim this, but I am thinking, for the sake of speed and alacrity, I will just take the rope. Oh, for God's sakes, really? I've got a sprained wrist as well. Um, I don't actually think I have any bandages left, do I? I do not. Okay, well, do I have cloth? I do. Tell you what then, game. I'm gonna just make some bandages. You know, thinking of it, I'm probably gonna need those before the end of this episode anyway, so I might as well just make four. Just like that. All right, game. Now, can I please climb down the rope? I mean, we're burning daylight here, and I don't like that. All right, Dave. Just go as quick as you can. Try not to burn too much energy, please. about half of what I had left gone. That's all right. You know what? We can drink some coffee. We have plenty of coffee. And we're thirsty anyway, so we should be able to get 
I think, well, at least two, maybe even three of them down our neck. And that'll wake us up enough to get moving. Okay, hopefully I'm remembering this right, and this is where I like to Skyrim down to get back to the uh, Draft Dodger's cabin. I mean, it's looking pretty promising. Okay, yep, there's the rope, so this is where we want to go down first. And now I think, rather than Skyrim over there, I will take the direct route. It's probably going to cost me a lot of energy, but... The rope seems like a good idea. I mean, after all, this is the last climb we're going to have to do in the challenge, so yeah, we might as well just go for it. There. Now all we need to do is make it across the entire Pleasant Valley map while we're dead tired and it's almost dark. Yeah, this is going to be fun. Alright, well, we made it to the bridge into uh, what I'm loosely going to call town. And yeah, this has so far been a pretty quiet walk. Now, there are potential wolf spawns from here to the cave we want to take, and a bear is a possibility as well. So yeah, I'm just going to hope that none of them are about, and the last well, couple of hundred yards of this journey will be just as quiet. Okay, well, so much for that. Hi. Bye. Really? Oh, for God's sakes, honestly. Why? Why did you do that? Why did you do that silly thing? I literally shot at you twice. You think you would have taken the hint. Alright, well, that's Pleasant Valley out of the way. Next stop, Coastal Highway. And welcome to Coastal Highway. Now all we gotta do is remember the quickest way to get down to the ice. All I can think about is food. I tell you what, I mean, we've been attacked a couple of times, but I think the strangest thing about doing these challenges is the difficulty level is... I think it's set to Voyager, maybe? But yeah, I'm not used to walking around this map and not being attacked like every five seconds. I mean, it's nice, don't get me wrong, but uh, yeah, it, it definitely feels a little bit weird. Okay, you know how to take a hint. You should have a chat with your brothers in Pleasant Valley. Soon. Oh, you don't need rest, Dave. What you need is more coffee. See? Isn't that better? Okay, well, we made it across Coastal Highway, and Dave is becoming his whiny little self again. So I'm thinking the quicker we can get him into the cave and over to Desolation Point, the happier I'm going to be. Yeah, that was exactly what I'm talking about. I mean, walking across this map without hearing a single bark is a profoundly strange experience. Okay, Dave, fire up the lamp. Let's get to Desolation Point and get this challenge over with, shall we? Okay, well, faithful little lamp, I need you no longer, so how about you stay here, and I'm going to head for the lighthouse. Alright, you know what? I think I want to end this thing with a bang. I mean, Dave is huffing like a jazzercise class at the moment, and, I mean, it's a shame we turned up at night, but, yeah, it's kind of dark anyway. So what say we end this thing like we began and do a little bit of chemical enhancement? Um, hold on. There's a wolf around here somewhere. Hi. Yeah, run away. I can't actually see. Oh, <laughs> you want to race, buddy? I mean, I'll race you. Holy crap, I'm actually kind of... Well, I was catching up to him. Oh, I'm catching up to him. Boo. 
Oh, don't run down the path, damn it. That's where I want to go. Oh, for God's sakes. All right, well, you know what? It is what it is. I'm just going to fire a few more shots at him. Um, Where'd the path go? There it is. Okay, we're all good. Let's keep moving. Hey, we made it to the lighthouse before the stim ran out. Cool. Alright, last bit of the journey. Let's hit the lights. And let's get upstairs. Ugh. Something's making me feel really tired. Uh, you know what, Dave? Here, I got one left. You can have it. I'm probably gonna regret this, but... Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. I mean, why not? Come on, Dave. Let's get to the finish line, shall we? Okay, we're here. I don't know who's supposed to see this thing, but the challenge wanted us to fire it, so... And there we go. Okay. We did that in three days, 12 hours, 16 minutes. And apparently, that is officially my best time. Now, I actually don't feel like... I did that all that well. I mean, we did take a couple of wrong turns and I spent a lot more time sleeping than I felt like I needed to. But yeah, I'll take it. And I tell you what, this was a really fun challenge to return to. I mean, I had forgotten how fun the challenges really are. And yeah, I think this might be something I revisit in the future. Maybe with the uh, go visit the gravestones one that I haven't tried before. But either way, we did pull this one off and we even did manage to set a record. So, yeah, as always, I have been Digby. I thank you guys for stopping by. I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode of The Long Dark. I know it was a little bit different, but it was still hopefully fun to watch. And, yeah, I hope to see you for the next one.